Oh, hey, it's me, your favorite teacher, Mr. Wilkes. Do not say Miss Darling. You know it's Mr. Wilkes. All right, let's get started. So we're learning about multiplication, and with multiplication, all you need to know is it's repeated addition. So if I have one item, and I count up the sides, such as this little triangle up here, I, well, you know it's a triangle, right? Oh, if you said a circle, you're wrong. One triangle. Okay, now with that triangle, count the sides. How many sides are there? I think I heard a 14. Say that again. How many sides? That's right. There are three sides on the triangle. One, two, and three. So, one triangle has three sides. Now, that would be the same as one times three, because one triangle times three sides still has three sides. Now, what if I had two of those triangles? Hmm. Let's think. Two triangles. Hmm. Plus... Oh, I'm going to put that as 2T. So, two triangles. And they each have... One, two, three, four, five, six sides. Two triangles, six sides. Two times three equals six. All right, let's try again. Let's try this one. You should have your whiteboards out. Come on, get your whiteboards if you don't have it out yet. We won't wait because we want to get moving, right? All right, how many triangles? That's right. There are three triangles. Good job. You can count to three. I'm so impressed. That'd be the same as three sides plus three sides plus three sides. Three, six, nine. Right. Now let's try again. Hmm. What comes after a three? Let's go ahead and let's put up four triangles this time. One, two, three, four. So we know this a couple of ways now, right? We could do three plus three plus three plus three. Or we know that the other one was three, six, nine. I could add three to that. But I could also do three sides or four triangles times the three sides to get that answer. So that would be three plus three plus three plus three. I know. Magic's a little slow today when we're writing this. It just comes up slow. Not magic the person, but the magic in this video. So, three, six, nine. What is it? Not 15, come on, slow down. Three, six, nine, 12. Okay, now, I know you can do that one. Sorry, I'm still using my magic to write that. Let's see, hmm, what would come next? Ah. Ooh, some of you already have caught on. Now on your whiteboard, see if you can do this. You know there's one, two, three, four, five. Now, can you do it as a times table? That would be five times how many sides? Five triangles times... That's right! Times three sides. So, you can count by three, five times three six, nine, 12. You can add three to the 12, right? Right there, we can add three to that number. That would do it. Or I could count three, six, nine, 12. <gasps> Who said 15? Why didn't you raise your hand? I would have called on you. Seriously, raise your hand, I'll call on you. All right, one more time. Let's see if you can do it on your own. So I'm gonna go ahead and draw them. Hocus Pocus, Alamogokus, you draw them. Your teacher may want to push pause so that you can solve it. But we'll wait. Let's think. What am I going to do? Hmm. Yep, I had 6 times 3 equals what? 6 times 3. Oh, count my 3 6 times. You can do it. 3. Or you can do 3 plus 3 plus 3 plus 3 plus 3 plus 3 plus 3. 6 times. Wouldn't it be easier just to do 6 times 3? You'll be able to do that before the end of the year. Trust me on that one. So, what was it? Oh, I did hear 18, and you are correct. Look at that right there. All right, go on to the next slide. It's time to do your assignment. You guys got this.